Hello friends, welcome to engineering tutorial. So, we will continue our discussion related to optoelectronics devices and systems. So, we will be discussing another optical phenomena uh, which is absorption of light. Okay? In the previous video, I said that we missed two uh, such uh, phenomena in our discussion related to uh, optical phenomena which was in the previous video we discussed double refraction, here we will be discussing absorption of light. So, everything the phenomena which we are discussing it is related to the propagation of light through optical fibers and fiber optic communication ok with respect to that. So, the different uh, interaction of light with uh, solid materials uh, it is covered in that. So, basically <coughs> the phenomena of absorption is that when light travels through matter, okay, the intensity of light as it passes through that material, it keeps on decreasing and that loss of energy okay, which is lost because of the decrease in intensity it is added to that material to that medium. So, let us say we know that uh, the three important interactions reflection and uh, refraction double refraction for anisotropic materials. So, reflection is basically light which strikes a uh, mirror reflecting surface it gets reflected with its angle of incidence and angle of reflection they are the same. Refraction when light travels from one medium to another of different refractive index whether it is rarer to denser or denser to rarer there is a change in the direction of light ok it bends either away or towards the normal. So, another such uh, phenomena which happens is that let us say light is striking a material ok any material some portion of it gets reflected some portion of it undergoes refraction and some portion of that light it gets absorbed ok no material is perfectly reflecting yeah mirror is a perfectly uh, you know reflecting surface still this phenomena happens but for a normal material ok for a normal material three phenomena happen when light strikes any material an object made of a particular material three such phenomena happen first a portion of that light which strikes the surface it gets reflected then a portion of the light it undergoes refraction depending on the refractive index of the medium one in which light is traveling and the refractive index of the material. Depending on that refraction happen, happens a portion of that light it undergoes refraction and some other portion of the light it undergoes absorption that is loss of intensity of light. So, here the decrease in intensity of light is dependent on the distance of the light traveling from the surface. Let us say we have a material light strikes here ok at this point and then it undergoes absorption and at this point the distance from the surface is r. Here let us say it is the original intensity of light at the surface the original intensity and we want to calculate the intensity after traveling through a distance or penetrating through a distance r the intensity of light at here this point. So, the intensity of light after traveling a distance r through the material it is given by this i is equal to the original intensity i 0 e to the power minus alpha r. So, intensity of light it decreases exponentially with distance in case of absorption. 
alpha is the absorption coefficient which is unique for different materials it is a constant which is for different materials it has different values so always remember when light strikes a material three important optical phenomena occur first a portion of light undergoes reflection following the usual laws of reflection portion of it undergoes refraction following the laws of refraction and then a portion of it undergoes absorption which leads to loss of intensity of light which follows this law okay and why we are discussing this uh, phenomena of absorption of light because we know that uh, uh, the optical fiber which is used for the you know carrying light signal from source to destination in fiber optic communication it consists of three parts core cladding jacket we know and as a result of which light ray it travels through multiple total internal reflections through the optical fiber we have already discussed it in detail now i will not go into that detail to you know elaborate this so simply light travels through multiple total internal reflection uh, reflections in between core and cladding cladding which is deliberately made of a higher refractive index so here the uh, all of the light which is focused from the source it does not undergo total internal reflection some portion with each successive total internal reflection some portion of the light it undergoes absorption let's use a different color okay some portion of light it travels into the cladding and undergoes absorption here some light goes then here also some loss occurs some absorption loss with each strike to the material to the cladding some absorption loss occur with each strike and as a result of which absorption loss happens there are also different other losses which we'll discuss but because of absorption absorption loss happens and as a result of which to at the destination the intensity of light is not the same which would it was at the source and at the destination different uh, you know signal processing device uh, circuitry is used to enhance the quality of the signal okay so this is one of such optical phenomena which leads to reduction in the quality of signal propagation okay with each successive total internal reflection as each light ray strikes the material the core cladding interface some portion of the light travels into the fiber into the cladding and is lost undergoes loss of intensity okay so there is a reduction in the signal intensity light intensity at the destination at the receiver side so this is why we are discussing about the phenomena of absorption okay so here we have discussed about uh, absorption optical phenomena so i hope you like this video and please subscribe my channel engineering tutorial for more such videos related to engineering science and technology have a great day thank you very much